Hi, this is Jason with Florida Solar Design Group. Today I'm going to show you some of the features of the Enphase Enlighten website. This is where you can monitor your Enphase solar energy system. I'm logged in here to a customer's site and looking at their daily production. Um, what we're doing right now is looking at today's production thus far. And you can see how much energy it produces on a 15 minute basis. Um, kind of go, going back, looking at different days here, you can see throughout the day how the energy production changed. S some days we have uh, great weather, some days in the middle of the day, weather can be kind of rough. There's a quick link to show you the weather on any given day in the upper right hand corner. Shows you the peak power produced on any given day. And this is really cool. This is a view of every single day that the system's been active. Um, the darker squares represent uh, 15 minute increments when there wasn't very good solar energy, and the bright blue or white uh, indicate very good solar production during that 15 minute window. And you put your mouse over any one of those squares, and, and down at the bottom it shows you where you are during the day. Um, you can pick the exact day through the day that the weather was really terrible, February 24th this year. You can see the morning wasn't too bad, but in the afternoon it rained all day, probably. Here we're looking at the detail of that one day. It shows you every 15 minute increment. There it is on the monthly view. You can look uh, month by month as well, but uh, ideally you're looking at your daily production and uh, determining what it was like on that given day. February 27th, on the other hand, was a great production day. You can see a nice smooth curve where solar energy peaked around 12, 12.30, and then the afternoon kind of trailed off. But uh, you can see nice bright white and blue throughout the day. Back to the overview, you can really jump around pretty easily between days, months, and hours. Um, get around just by clicking on any given day see what the production was that day. And look at your, go back to the grid view and see the little squares. Really easy to jump around. And this goes back all the way to the very beginning of system production. So uh, it has 15 minute increments all the way back to day one. Now down here at the bottom, you can run a bunch of different reports. Uh, the most basic is the daily production report. Last 30 days, it just shows the kilowatt hour production for each day. Um, doesn't give you any detail into the hours here, but this gives you your last month worth of data. You can take this and bring it into Excel or any of your favorite programs for analysis. Um, you can do a monthly production report. We'll look at last month, uh, May 2016. On the report, and this is very much like what you get in your email every month. It gives you a little synopsis of weekly power production, power production for the month, the prior month, and year to date. You can also do a recent production report. Now, this one will give you very detailed information down to the um, every report period, every five minute report from the Envoy device, um, your gateway, it's going to give you the production in that five minute window, or actually the, the power production, power output in that five minute window. It's really neat. Again, you can export all this data to Excel sheets. So now I want to show you the Enphase Enlighten Manager. This is the more robust version that installers have access to. We can see all the same data that we could in the My Enlightened website, but we can actually see the, the same data on a panel by panel basis. So down to each panel, uh, we can get some really robust information on energy production for days, weeks, hours, moments. Um, and then on top of that, we can get voltage information too. 
this helps us identify panels that are not producing as much power as others or any problems that might occur, uh, microinverters that are down, panel production issues, um, shading issues, soiling issues, anything like that that might reduce your production. This is a really neat view where you can see a little video of panel production throughout the day. In this particular home, there's uh, panels that are south, west, and east. So in the morning, the uh, east panels get better production. In the afternoon, the west get better production. And it's really neat watching it day to day, hour to hour. You can slow it down, look at seven days at a time. You can almost tell the weather from these monitoring systems um, throughout the day. You know, the first two days in this week looked pretty good. The third day had some midday rain or clouds. Um, you can really dig down and see what the weather was on any given day and see how each panel is reacting to it. You can pick a date range. Again, going back all the way to the beginning of production for the system. This was a really great week until the end of the week, it looks like. Each day had some pretty stable power production, nice curves. But at the end of the week, uh, looks like the second to last day, it was a really cloudy day all day. This probably all seems very basic and expected nowadays, but just a few years ago, this wasn't available. You couldn't get this kind of module level data um, and, and have it output to a web portal for easy viewing. Uh, it's just amazing from an installer perspective, you can diagnose issues, and from the homeowner's perspective, you can make sure your system is putting out the power that, that, you, that you purchased. Now we can get right down to the microinverter level. So we're zooming in on one particular panel here, looking at the power production for that one panel. We can compare it to the panels adjacent, to see how it's working out. Any deficiencies can be addressed um, Sometimes remotely, sometimes it requires a site visit to see what's going on. The graph interface is terrific for, uh, for the installer to uh, see the voltage of the panel, the DC current, AC voltage, frequency, and temperature at any given moment. Helps us diagnose issues. You can determine if there's a, a grid problem or a microinverter problem or perhaps a panel problem. Narrow in on any uh, any issues that exist. By putting the mouse over any of the points, we can see exactly what's going on at any given moment. Turn everything on and uh, get all the data points for any, any moment just by mousing over on the graph. Extremely helpful. We have all the same reporting capability, but down to the module level or microinverter level. We can look at any events, um, GFI trips, um, panel production issues, any events that the system records. And again, really dig into what's going on with your system to help monitor it remotely. Okay, so we'll go back to the full system here. Look at today's energy production again. We'll notice some of those panels there on the south and west haven't caught up to the east yet. It got a little cloudy in the afternoon. This is the kiosk view. You can set up a iPod, iPad kiosk or something um, to show your system performance. This is great for commercial clients that want to have something in their lobby that shows energy production. Real nice, clean, easy way with uh, limited functionality, but really allows, uh, allows customers to see what's going on with the system without having too much detail. Gives you things like the daily energy production and uh, shows you the lifetime production. We can get down into the device list. Shows you exactly what serial numbers of all the microinverters you have. 
the system has 21 microinverters. Shows you the lifetime energy for each unit. It's a real quick and easy way to spot problem panels, if any. That one down there at the bottom was replaced. It's a newer uh, integrated ground unit that was replaced um, to deal with a, a problem inverter. So, of course, the lifetime energy will be lower for that than the others. So that's just a quick overview of the Enphase My Enlighten and Enlighten Manager websites. There's a lot more to see, a lot more depth to get into. Uh, it's real fun being able to see your own system, and it's real helpful for us as an installer to be able to dig into your system performance. One of the things that makes the Enphase Microinverter system um, a great choice for you. And if you have any questions about it, give us a call. Be happy to answer your questions. Thank you.